My name is Kurt Goldsberry. I currently am a sports writer at ESPN. I cover the NBA for ESPN. I'm also an author of basketball books, and I teach sports analytics at the University of Texas in Austin. Geography shaped my career uh, in a big time way. First of all, I was sort of struggling at Penn State to find my direction and I, I took a couple classes by Cindy Brewer and that really shaped my vision for my career because I, I fell in love with cartography and GIS. Those are two things I still use every day. Uh, now to map basketball data, uh, communicate basketball findings to NBA teams and to an ESPN audience. I fell in love with cartography and I started applying it to sports data in the 2010s and that really propelled me to become a, a front office executive with the San Antonio Spurs, the lead analyst for the 2016 gold medal Team USA basketball team and now at ESPN as a lead analyst for their NBA coverage. One of the things I like to think about geography is the science of where. Uh, so it helps us answer a lot of questions about place. Uh, and for me, basketball analytics and basketball analysis was really missing that element, uh, where things were happening in games and how that affected uh, performances. Uh, and so I was really able to take some of the fundamental concepts from my GIS classes here at Penn State and my cartography lessons here at Penn State and apply them to emerging spatial data sets in pro basketball and help uh, basketball people really understand more about the performers they, they love to watch. In 2012, I presented my first basketball paper at MIT, and it was, it was a way to use thematic cartography to visualize the spatial shooting tendencies of NBA players and identify what they were good at, where they were active, where they weren't active, and help the league and players really understand for the first time the interactions between hyper-specific spatial locations on the basketball court and performances. Uh, and so that was very innovative, but it was also pretty basic GIS and cartography just applied in a new way. 